Yeah. Where is he with that? First thing we talked about was leadership, you know, just being a professional every day, coming and doing your work every single day, growing the, the curiosity of the game. A lot of time, a lot of the summer and early in the season, we spent time on managing the game. And I think you're seeing growth in that area in fourth quarters. You know, at times he drives me crazy, maybe for the first three quarters, but in the fourth quarter, he's at his best. He's much more solid there. He's managing the game to close out a win for us. So we really talked, we spent a lot of time managing, talking about management of this team, both time score situation, who to get a shot for, when to get a shot, who's hot, what would we call in those situations? A lot of situational talk we, we spent time on. And then the, the uh, defensive end. We spent a lot of time on the defensive end, just his coverage is number one. I think the, you know, as the thing in, in with defense and young players in this league, half, half the battle defensively is just anticipating what's about to happen and not reacting to it. Where Mello is just, you know, we're, we're trying to get him more comfortable with being aware of what's about to happen, whether it's a pick and roll, a pin down, something on the weak side. So that awareness, his defensive awareness on and off the ball is something we spent a lot of time on. And, uh, and as I said, the leadership already. You talk about the team kind of driving you crazy in a good way. I mean, you look at his nights, 15, 10, 10, I think eight turnovers. Yeah, almost a quadruple double. Yeah. It was two, I should have, yeah. I should have kept them in. You get a few more turnovers. I mean, do you live with that though? The turnovers are obviously a little high probably, but I mean, is, that, is that okay with you? I have to live with some of that, but I think there there's, there's growth there for all of us that if I throw one, and I lose it, I'm not gonna try it again within a few possessions. And he's done a good job in that area this year. We're one of the lowest turnover teams in the NBA, and he's probably our highest usage guy. So I'm not, I don't wanna jump to, there's growth here, there's progress here for him, right? You know, when you think back to last year, you know, those turnovers were too high. I think one of the strengths of our offense right now, when you look at our numbers, is our low turnover number. Tonight was not that for him, okay? so. There's some of that. I, I've got to let him be mellow and be creative and, and in, you know live in that improv world. But there's also got to be some awareness from him as well. Okay, I just tried it. It didn't work out solid now. And that's just growth.